What's up guys, it's FaZe here and today we are going to go over a few summer seaside soiree fishing tips in Survivor.io. We'll talk about the best strategies and how to find emperor fish. Make sure to like and subscribe for more. All right, guys, I tested a lot of stuff out and there are a few things I have confirmed. There are essentially two strategies when it comes to fishing here. One of them is to use multicast and the other one is to find emperor fish fishing one at a time, letting fish go over 200 meters if you don't think that they are emperor fish and exchanging the broken fishing line here for fishing lures in the exchange shop. I want to conclude, they both kind of work. I was able to get emperor fish using both strategies and there is one thing I noticed. To tell if you have an emperor fish on your line right away, it's it's probably going to swim to about 150 or 160 meters in red right away. It's also going to put up a fight when you try to reel it in. But this is not going to be an emperor fish. It seems like a normal fish. It only fought me once. So I'm going to let it go over 200 meters. I'm going to let it go. I will get a broken fishing line in return. And then I can head here to the exchange and exchange it for fishing lure. But as you see, I've already run out. I've already tested all of this out. Here's a video where we tested these theories out and came to this conclusion. We're going Going to use a nice strategy that everyone's been talking about. There's a whole guide about it on the official Survivor.io Discord. If you want to check it out, I'll leave a link to it in the description of this video. So our objective is to catch Emperor Fish. And for a lot of players, the objective is to complete the handbook here and get the rewards. So in order to do that, we're going to go over a few things while we use 50 lures to catch fish. First of all, I want to try this one at a time. Our objective is to catch an emperor fish, so let's let go of our line right there. And in order to tell if this is an emperor fish on our line, it's going to struggle. It's going to be in red a lot, so I'm going to hold on to this yellow button and let's see if we can pull it towards us without a struggle. As you see, it's giving us a little bit of a struggle here. Normally, if they don't give you a struggle, it might be a normal fish and you might want to let it go. Let's see, it's giving us more struggle here, so that's two times. When it goes red right there, you want to let go of this yellow button so you don't break the line. Keep note of the meter on the right side, the yellow meter right there. And it's giving us more struggle. In yellow or green, you want to hold this line down. Also, okay, here we go. And we caught a rare fish. So as you saw, it gave us a lot of struggle there and it ended up to be a rare fish. Let's try that again. Perfect, let's go. It's giving us a little bit of a struggle here. It's going over 120 meters. Now let's hold the yellow button down. Let's see if it will fight us again. It's not fighting us. It's not fighting us. Now it's yellow. We're pulling it up to us. Let's hold this yellow button down so we can just reel it in. Now it's green, it's green. It's just a normal fish. It weighs 5.89 kilograms though. In that case, it may have been better to let go of the line. It may have been better to let that fish go over 200 meters and get a broken fishing line, which we can then use here in the exchange for new lure. So there we go. We erased what happened there and we got new lure. Let's go fishing again. Well done. Just how I like my steak. Let's hold this yellow button down here. And as you see, if we hold it down much longer, it's going to break. It's going red around 50 meters right there, but it's staying green. It's staying too green for my liking. Now it's red. Now it's yellow. Let's pull it through. Let's pull it up to us. Let's hold this button down. Now it's green. It's staying green. It's going red. So that fish gave us a lot of struggle and it turned out to be a rare fish that weighs 18.15 kilograms. So I guess if a fish struggles with you that much, if it goes red that much, especially under 100 meters, it might be a rare fish. I need to find an emperor fish though. Let's go. So let's hold this line down. Okay, I don't want to hold it down much longer. Now it's in yellow around 120 meters. Let's pull it towards us. If it goes, it's staying green. It's staying green. I'm going to let this go. I'm going to get the broken fishing line and I'm going to exchange it here in the shop for more lure. We're back to 48. I want to get that perfect, but I keep getting it well done. Okay, let's go. Let's hold this line. If we do any longer, it's going to break. Now it's in yellow. Let's pull it towards us. It's not really fighting us that much. It's not fighting us at all. So let's let this one go. Okay, let's go fishing. That was perfect. I forgot to buy lure in the shop. I'll do that next time. Okay, this one is actually right out of the gate going red pretty fast, but look at that. We are easily pulling this in. It's under 100 meters. It's staying green. It's not fighting us. So we have to let this one go. Don't ask why I have my sleeves rolled up. This shirt is way too big for me. There we go. We're back to 48. Perfect. Let's go. Is this a big boy? Is it a small boy? Is it a small king? It seems like a small one right away. It's under 100 meters. It's staying yellow. 
it's coming in very easily. Let's let this one free. There are plenty of fish in the sea. Here we go. This one isn't putting up much of a fight either. Go join your buddies out in the sea. I don't want you. This shirt has the American flag on it. That's why I'm wearing it. It's not, not like I'm, I'm not like a patriot. Okay, look at this. Let's go. This, okay, this one is a bigger fish. It is going out far to sea. Check it out. It went over 150 meters. So let's hold down this yellow button. Okay, it's going red again. It's giving us more of a fight. Let's reel it in. Let's see what we got here. We have a rare fish. So that one swam out pretty far and it put up a little bit of a fight there. So the further out they swim, the more of the fight they put, the more they weigh. Let's see. This one is fighting us a little bit there, but you know what? It's not swimming out that far. So I'm going to let it go. We can just keep on recycling lures until we get what we want. This one is putting up a fight and swimming further than the others. So let's try to reel it in. It's not putting up a fight anymore. It's putting up a fight now. That's once. Okay, let's reel it in again. Will it put up another fight? Will it put up? It's staying yellow. Now it's going green. Let's reel it in. Okay, what are you? It's a rare fish. Okay, this one is not putting up much of a fight. It's not swimming out far either. We can just reel it in if we want, but I don't want to. I have too much lure. And that was a perfect cast right there. A phase cast, some might say. This one is swimming out pretty far. It's not too far though. It could be a normal fish that weighs a lot. What is it? It is a normal fish. Just two points. 0.93 kilograms. It didn't put up much of a fight, so that was actually pretty easy to tell. And look at this. I landed on the black there. I didn't get any green. But this one is fighting us. This one is fighting us. Okay, and it's swimming out pretty far. But it's not fighting us anymore. It's staying green. Now it's going red. Now it's yellow. Okay. This might be a normal fish that weighs a lot, but it's a rare fish. We caught a rare fish by landing on the black right there. No emperor fish yet. We have to get perfect. There we go. We got it. And now let's see. Let's see. This one is... Uh, it's not giving a fight. It's not going a distance. We can pull it in very easily. It's staying green. Let's get rid of it. Okay, let's go. Get perfect. Yes, we did it right there. Check out that moon. That moon is pretty. The background is pretty. We can just reel it in just like that. We're going to have to let this one go. Get out of here. We still have 44 lures. Let's go. Let's do this. Is this going to be an emperor fish? We have no emperor fish yet. I don't think this one is going to be an emperor fish. No fight. It's staying green. We can pull it in very easily. Let's let it go. We can exchange three more broken lines here. We have 20 more chances there, 20 more chances right here, and so on. Perfect cast. Let's see if we can get an emperor fish here. I'm feeling lucky. Okay, so, okay, uh, nope, I'm not feeling lucky anymore. It's not putting up a fight. We can just hold the yellow button down and reel it in, so I'm going to let this one go. Perfect. We're just having a good time fishing here. This one's not fighting us. This one is not swimming out far. We can just reel it in. It's staying green. Let's get rid of it. Yeah, swim like that all you want. I'm not reeling you back in, buddy. Well done done. Thank you. Okay, this one is fighting us a little bit more than other fish. Let's reel it in. Let's see what happens. It's going under 100 meters. Now it's getting very easy. It's staying green. I'm going to let it go. We're still at 44 fishing lures. Okay, this one is staying at around 130. Okay, it's going pretty far. Let's hold the yellow button down here. Let's see if it's going to fight us. Will it fight us? Nope, it's going green. And okay, it's fighting us once. Now it's at yellow. It's going to be an easy fight. Can we pull it in? No, I, don't, I don't trust it. I don't like my fish to be that green, so I'm going to let this one go. Perfecto. Let's go. If it's perfect, then increase my chances. Give me something good. Give me an emperor fish. This doesn't seem like it would be an emperor fish. It's too easy to catch here. So yeah, that's way too easy to catch. Let's let it go. We're back at 44 fishing lures. It really doesn't matter where we land here, I don't think. Okay, this one is putting up a fight. I kind of like this one right here. Now it's staying green and we can just easily pull it in. I don't like that at all. I'm going to let it go. Perfect. Thank you. This one seems pretty easy to reel in. It didn't give us much of a fight right away, so let's let it go. Perfect. Okay, let's see. Can we get something here? I would really like to find an emperor fish. Wow, that one is fighting us right away. Check out this fight. Okay. Is the fight worth it right there? Let's see. Is that initial fight going to be worth it? Now it's an easy pull. It's fighting us once more. Okay. This one is fighting us a little bit more than the others, but it seems like it, yeah, it's going to be a normal fish. It didn't seem to give us enough of a fight. It still weighs six. 6.49 though. Okay, and this one is fighting us right away too, and it's swimming out pretty far. Wow, it is swimming out very far. This one has to be an emperor fish. If this is not an emperor fish, I will be very upset, but we are easily reeling it in right there. It's staying red. I don't want to break the line. I'm just going to tap there when it turns red. I don't want to hold... Just tap, just tap. I don't want it to swim too far. I don't want too much tension. I don't want to break the line. We have to reel this one in. This has to be an emperor fish. This might be the biggest fish ever caught in real life and in games. This is a battle between man and beast. 
I can't take my eyes away. I looked down in the corner because I saw something move. Let's reel it in. I almost broke the line there. Don't swim away from me, buddy. We can catch it. We can catch it. We can catch it. What is it? We caught an emperor fish. Finally, check this out. 148.8 kilograms. We got emperor fish proof. We got 14,000.8 fishing points. We got gems. I love it. So pretty much out of 50 or out of whatever, we're down to 42 lures here and we have one emperor fish. The way we did this is simply by seeking out emperor fish and intentionally breaking our line, letting go of normal fish, and just playing this strategically. It takes a long time as well. I started with 50 or whatever I showed you guys in the video. I'm down to 42. It's been taking a while. Here's perfect. We did it. Let's see. Can we get more? Can we get more? This one's fighting us a little bit, but not enough. Not like the other one was. So look at this. I'm going to let this one go. As you saw, the emperor fish gave me a lot of struggle. It's going to give you a lot of fight. We can get the broken fishing line, come here to the exchange, and exchange it for more fishing lure. We're back to 42. Let's go. Right there. Perfect. I want another emperor fish. This one's fighting a little bit, but not enough. Not like the emperor fish did. I'll see you later. Let's see what happens if we drop the line way out here in the black. Maybe fish are hiding out here. You never know. Doesn't seem like it. I'm going to let this one go. Go. Get out of here, you little guppy. So much fishing, so little lure used. We're back to 42 fishing lure here. This one is fighting us. All right. But now we can easily pull it in. Way too easily. What is this? So this one gave us a little bit of a fight. It swam up pretty far. And then it went green and we can just easily pull it in. This has to be a normal fish. Yep, a normal fish. 1.86. What were you doing, buddy? Why did you try to trick me? Perfect. Let's see if we can catch something here. Oh, this one is fighting us, but not enough. See you later. Perfect. Okay, let's see. Can we catch something here? It's not fighting us like the emperor fish did. We can easily pull it in. I'm going to let it go. Perfect. I landed on perfect there. Okay, this one is swimming out far and giving us a fight. This has to be rare or an emperor fish. Let's pull it in. It's not making this easy. Let's pull it in. It's staying pretty far out there. Okay, it's staying green. Don't get tricked by it. Let it go right there when it turns red. Now stay yellow here. Stay yellow. We're pulling it in. We're Now it's green. Don't get tricked by it though. Okay, don't get tricked. So I'm going to hold down when it's yellow or green there. It's staying green. Let's see. What are you? You are a rare fish. 29.7 kilograms. We have 40 fishing lures. Okay. This one is fighting us. This one. Nope. Not anymore. We can easily pull this one up to us. So let's let it go. Okay. We landed on perfect there. Let's see. Are we going to get something? It gave us a little bit of a struggle there, but now we can easily pull it in. So I'm going to let it go. I don't want to get tricked by another lantern fish. Okay. This one is fighting us. This one is fighting, but it's not swimming out too far. It's going up to about 120 meters. Now it's going under 100. Way too too fast, way too quickly. Get out of here. You got to take it slow with me. I've been through a lot. Back to 40. Perfect. Can we get something good here? Give me something good. Nope. It doesn't look like it. Not at all. Okay. Let's let this one go. Okay. This one is way too easy to pull in. Let's let it go. Perfect. Okay. This one is swimming out far. This one is fighting. Now it's going yellow at about 160 meters. Let's pull it in. It's going green. It's going green. Will it go red again? It's going red one more time. I don't believe this will be an emperor fish, but let's just check it out. It's only fighting us once. It is a normal fish. It swam out far, but it didn't really give us much of a fight. And that's how you can tell. This one did not swim out far. It's not putting up much of a fight. I'm going to let it go. Okay, we landed on perfect there. This one swam out to about 120 meters, but it's not putting up much of a fight. It really did not swim out too far either. So let's let it go. Can we catch an emperor fish? We landed on perfect. This one is swimming out, you know, a decent distance. It's not really fighting us that much. Now it's going green. This one is definitely not worth our time. Let's let it go. We got to cut it loose. Perfect. Let's see if it matters though. Okay. This one is uh, not worth it. I think right away you can kind of tell that it's not going to be an emperor fish. If it doesn't swim out to, you know, about 160 meters, this one went about to, you know, more than others. This one did not put up much of a fight. I'm going to have to let it go. This one's about 120, 130. And you know, I can easily pull it in. It's going to fight me once here, but it's not going to fight me again. So this one is probably a normal fish. Just to prove it, I'll pull it in. Here's a normal fish for you. And let's see, can we find a rare or emperor fish? So this one's not putting up much of a fight. It's also going to be a normal fish. So in reality, I can just keep on doing this until I run out of fishing lure in the shop. I'm back at 38 fishing lure here. I started with 50 or whatever I said. One hour later. 
I can only buy four more lures with broken fishing line. Let's do five at a time and let's just pull them in regardless of what they are. We're gonna pull these in, we're going to pull these in. As you see, they're really not swimming out far and we can easily pull them in without a struggle. We had one little struggle right there. They're just normal fish though. Okay, let's do that again. I'm just letting go of all this fishing lure here. We're doing times five right here and we're just pulling everything in. These didn't swim out far either. They have to be normal as well. There's one little fight there under 10 meters and they're all normal fish. Here's a perfect cast. These are going way too far. 160 meters. Okay, this seems like it's going to be a fight. Nope, not anymore. It's staying green. There's a little fight there. I don't want to break the line. I'm not sure if this is an emperor fish, maybe a rare fish because it doesn't feel like the other emperor fish, but now it does because it's swimming out very far. It's very hard to tell. Okay, now it's coming in very easily and it's putting up another fight. It's putting up another fight. This can go either way. It's either a rare or emperor fish. I think if it fights me again, one more time like that and goes over 100 meters. It has to be an emperor fish. It has to be. Okay, here we go. It's coming in easily. It's coming in easily. It's fighting me one more time. It's going up to 60 meters right there. Okay. Okay, let's see. What are you, buddy? We caught another emperor fish, a megalodon, 158.4 kilograms. Also, check out these rare fish as well. Let's go again. And here we go. Let's pull them towards us. Yep, normal fish. So another theory people were talking about was using this multicast feature. And that's actually how I caught all of my emperor fish before. And here we go. Look at this. They are swimming out pretty far there, but I don't think they're emperor fish. They didn't swim out to, you know, 160 meters. Okay, we got two rare fish there. They put up a little bit of a fight. Okay, we landed on black there. That was not a good cast. Let's see if it matters. Let's see if it matters. They swam out pretty far in red to about 140 meters, but let's pull them towards us. Let's see what this is. Okay, they fought me twice. Two rare fish. I'm getting a lot of rare fish from these multicasts here. I have four lures. I'm going to spend gems to get a fifth. Okay, and let's pull these fish in regardless of what they are. Oh, oh, there's one fight right there. I almost broke my line. They are rare fish. So multicast seems to be a little different here. We're getting a bunch of rare fish. We got one emperor fish as well. We are also down to zero fishing lures. There are so many strategies when it comes to the summer seaside soiree fishing event in survivor.io. And I just try to test some of them right now. So what we learned here today is that you can pretty much use any strategy. You can use the multicast strategy. You can test the waters by doing it one at a time. If the fish swims to about 150 meters in red, it could be an emperor fish. The further it swims in red, the more of a fight it puts, the better chance you have of getting an emperor fish. And if it's not, you might just want to let it go. Get that fishing lure and exchange it. That's it for now. If you have any questions or tips, please leave a comment below. Thank you so much for watching. Smash like and subscribe. I'll see you later.